Are you serious? Are you serious? Thousands of people have rallied in the Istanbul, Turkey against Israel, against Israel and its al Ask mosque measures of security. Matter of fact, over at the crusaderjournal.com, Bart Begley has a report. Thousands of people have rallied in Turkey's largest city, Istanbul, today against security measures Israel has imposed on the al Ask Mosque. That is up on the Temple Mount in Jerusalem. Matter of fact, shortly after Israel removed other measures that led to the two weeks of violence of Palestinian protesting. But remember why Israel did it. Remember why they did it. Because three Palestinians just went up onto the Temple Mount and shot and murdered two Israeli police officers for no reason. So Israel says, okay, we're going to put metal detectors. And the Muslims went crazy worldwide over that. Oh, no, 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 no. Well, what do you want us to do? What do you want anybody to do? Any free society. Jews and Christians have to go through metal detectors, no problem. And they're not even allowed to pray on the Temple Mount. So, I mean, the hypocrisy is really getting old, guys, getting real old. But you see, there's so many people that have been deceived by such propaganda in the media. Um, this article written by uh, two Muslims for Reuters. Okay. Now, protesters were brought in by buses and ferries from across the city. And I'm not against Muslim people. Trust me. I'm against uh, whenever people are being violent in the name of any God is not right. Um, anyway, they brought them in by buses and ferries, waving Turkish and Palestinian flags. And this is not good. If Turkey is turning on Israel, you're talking Ezekiel 38. And with Russia just announcing that they're going to stay in Syria for 50 years and with the Iranians sitting there with them, then you've got Turkey, Russia, and Iran sitting at the doorstep of Israel because Turkey's in Syria also. And, they're, and, and, and then throw in Ethiopia and throw in Libya and throw in the rest of the uh, Arabic world and you've got a problem. We're going to talk about all this tonight. Don't miss it on Sunday Night Live. I'm back here in the studio. We've had a powerful, powerful three uh, summer fire. Uh, Eight people saved, uh, seven baptized, and and packed house every service. Incredible. What a great time we had. Anyway, give your life to Jesus Christ, folks. We're running out of time, and I'm telling you, we are running out of time. Are you saved?